is nice and warm today. This is like a new angle. <laughs> okay, so what's up? Day two. We're gonna get these envelopes, and before I leave, I'm gonna check real quick. And yes, Jesus got my card. All right, so we're gonna try round two of actually going to get this doggone envelopes. Go to the store, go get the envelopes. It's a little bit of afternoon, so I was able to do some morning things this morning. It's actually late in the afternoon. I don't have, I have to go to work. <laughs> How about that? So yeah, I gotta go to work. But it's only like for four hours because we close early, so. Yay that. I already went ahead and did my eyeshadows on camera, as you know, in my last video. I like to do that. I have my whole makeup bag in my case of a palette so that way i can do my eyeshadow so thankfully the store is right next to my job so i'm just gonna go for a little walkie walk and go get my envelopes and i may also do a little walk around around the little quad it's like right next to right next to the mall so here we go Let's get it. Let's go. Really? Only 80? <laughs> Gonna have to get two. Call it a day. Everybody and their mama is out here. <laughs> it's a lot. This is flipping cool. This is dope.
Yo, that store, that store was really, really cool. That was so dope. No, I didn't buy anything. I thought about it, but. Sister girl's on a budget, so I can't do that. Maybe another time, we'll see. Okay, so just got home from work. It was like a long day. So I was gonna show um, what happened at the, the brand Americana, but I couldn't be able to because it was late that I kind of got out, so I wasn't able to do so. But I did purchase my envelopes. This is 80. I got the 81 and then I also got the 55 count. I don't know why, but I love covers. For some reason, I love sitting down with my cover. I like to eat with my cover, sleep with my cover. I just love my cover. All right, so I got this. So here is my first envelope and I'm gonna put So one, I'm gonna go to my wallet real quicky. And I got a dollar. Actually, it's crazy because um, I, I don't know about you, but I remember when um, I was walking because it was crazy. I was just waiting at, you know, at my job and just waiting in my car to go to work and I was walking and I walked and I totally forgot about my mask. So I walked back and for some reason on the ground, I saw like a lump, a clump of money. It's been a while since I've seen something like this, but I don't know, have anyone had that where you were walking and you was going someplace and you just saw money on the ground? I think the most I've seen was like a $10 bill. But it was crazy. And so I saw it and then I saw a lady walking. So I went up to her and I said, hey, did you drop some money? She was like, no, I didn't drop any money. So I'm sitting here and it's like, okay. And I'm looking around, there was nobody else around. I didn't know who it would belong to. So it was like, okay. So I tied it, I said, thank you, Lord. And um, I think it was like $7. But I spent like six because I think I was doing something. But I also tithed a dollar because I'm a tither. I don't care what anyone else says. I'm a tither. So that's what I did. So I've had this one dollar bill in my wallet for a while. So it's crazy enough that this is my first one dollar bill um, to start this journey. And I got one. So here it is. I'm going to date it. So it's the 20. 21. So this is the first of many. I'm gonna try to find a nice, beautiful, fancy basket and I'm gonna put that in there. But here's one. It was really cool to go to um, Stranger Things store. It was really, really fun. I, I didn't buy anything, as you saw, which is okay, because I kind of just wanted to walk around and look at it because, you know, I saw this store and it did say they're like closing soon or like a limited time, you know, um, that they're gonna be open. So it was really cool um, to see uh, it. And I've seen the show. It's a really good show. I've seen all three seasons. There's a fourth one, I believe. 
that is um, out right now. I haven't seen the new one, but I have been seeing it from the beginning, which is really cool. And I like how, I like the show because how everything is like highlighted in like the 80s, which is really cool. It's like the early 80s. I'm not an 80s baby, I'm a 90s baby, but it was, it, but I still like the 80s and the culture and the music and the clothing. It's so cool to see how everything has evolved now, but I also like how they created a show that's like back in that era which was the 80s and you get to see this like the their type of phones the clothing the style the 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 electronics and how that was back in that 80s time and how they brought that back and i also like how they use a new generation for that as well because when you see the show it's kids and you see them grow but it just shows how much it's cool to appreciate those times because you know nowadays it's all about what's popular and out now but there was amazing style that happened back in those times like the 60s 70s and and 80s and it's crazy how there there's this, there's this quote that there's nothing new underneath the sun and there literally isn't all things do is just come back out and it's just be revamped but it's crazy when you see things there's always an original in I just like how that is so it's really really cool but yeah it was really really cool doing the stranger things that was cool and i'm very very grateful and excited i had i got my envelope so that's i got my envelope so i'm excited about this journey to start on so yeah i'm just looking forward to it i hope you guys all have a wonderful christmas eve and uh, merry christmas to everyone else as well um uh, remember the true reason for this season <laughs> It's all about, you know, Jesus and the gift. And I just hope and pray that, you know, as you guys move forward, that just remember, don't let just this season be the only time of giving. Let it be every single day. Like Jesus wasn't a gift just for a day. He was a gift for a long time. And anytime we need someone to, anytime we need repentance or someone to, or a reminder of you know no matter what we do as long as we bring it before god and repent and turn up from our ways jesus paid the price so it's not just something for just a season it's for every single day so hopefully tomorrow and today was not the only time you give i hope you've been given all year round i get it sometimes like i gotta get to a spirit of giving but let the spirit of giving be happen all the time and another gift that you know Jesus has given us as well is how powerful and, and important the Holy Spirit is as well. So just keep that in mind. If it's a cot, if you want to go with conscious or whatever, I say the Holy Spirit because that's another form of communication. Because in the Word we got introduced to God and then to Jesus, and then the last one for the Trinity is the Holy Spirit, which is the one that dwells inside of us so just keep that in mind for all of you out there who wants to understand more about how god is and how he operates so um don't just be in the spirit of giving but let the holy spirit <laughs> guide you as well and how to give on an uh, everyday or on a normal basis and not just wait for a holiday to finally do so so without with all that said thank you guys so much and uh yeah have a wonderful day and tia joy is out <laughs>